with his nose. <laughs> okay. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, if you're new, my name is Samaja, and this is my lovely mom here. Um, so, uh, you've seen her in a previous video, old vlog. We went to Curl Fest, you met her there. Her appearance is different because she's a chameleon. She likes to change her looks, her ways. So, yeah, we're gonna do. I'm sorry. The hood. What do you want? Hood I mean, fireworks. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. So I'm, I'm really sorry about that, but I can't do anything about that. Anyway, um, this is, uh, this is kind of annoying. Uh, but um, yeah, so we're going to do a version of a mom tag. I tried to find questions that were like the exact mom tag, but they were like a little too serious. And we're here to have fun, you know, it's the new year, you know, night life, you know, be fun and cheery. <laughs> so, uh, the list I found is 50 questions. I don't think we're going to answer and ask all 50 questions, so we're going to do like about half. Um, people have things to do tomorrow, like my mom has to work. <laughs> and so, yeah, we're, and I have to edit. I don't want to edit 50 questions. <laughs> so, we're going to do 25, and so if you want to know more about my mom, and so let's just... Keep on watching. Okay, mom. So the first question is, when I was little, what did you think I was going to be when I grew up? Wow, that's an amazingly hard question for number one. What's number five going to be? Right. Uh, honestly, I thought you were going to do something artistic because you were very creative and a little offbeat as a kid and still are. Hence, uh, I honestly thought you were going to do something like paint or a sculpt or something like that. Or sing because when you started to sing, I thought, but you know, yeah. singers don't really make that. That is very true, especially but, when they yeah, start. Yeah, I just, I, I always knew you were going to be something creative, but I thought it would be more like an artistic, like a sculptor or a painter or, or sort of thing. The question is, do you think I have more of your good qualities or bad qualities? My good ones. Good ones. You, you definitely have more of my good qualities. I think you try to see the best in people. Um, you're always very kind. Um, you're very giving, um, you're usually very understanding and communicative. I can be those things a lot of the time, sometimes more. My friends would probably say I'm a little too nice. Yes. Sometimes. <laughs> um, you don't have very many of my bad qualities. The one bad quality, the two bad qualities, I don't want to call them bad, but lesser qualities would be we tend to cocoon ourselves when we're kind of like emotionally yeah. overwrought. Our, our tendency is to just kind of like close ourselves off um, and temper. Yeah. You have, you have very bad tempers. We do. If it's I've bad. ever it's snapped bad. at you in any way, shape, or form, I'm sorry. Yeah. It's, yeah. Uh, anyway, yeah. So temper would probably be the one, the one not nice thing that you have of mine. We have yeah. very, very similar temperaments. However, Deadly. It's, <laughs> it's gotten better, um, both of us, as I've gotten older than she's gotten older. Uh, the next question is, when was the first time you heard me curse? You, you don't remember, do you? <laughs> I don't really know, because I, I'm i pretty free with the swear words. Yeah, I mean, um, we, we heard her curse early on, so. Um, not at, not, not at you, us, but like, but just. But I, when I'm frustrated, I, yeah. say, I say, my word of choice is, God damn it. Yeah. I, say, I say it a lot. Um, yeah, usually at myself. Yeah, uh, but I, I don't. I can't really say. Probably when you were living in PA, and you and your teens, and you were around your cousins a lot. Um, I would rowdy, just hear you rough. Yeah, 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 I was rowdy, 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 rowdy. But that was more dealing with each other. But it wasn't like clutch my pearls. Yeah. Just like oh, we never really yeah. filtered things. Yeah, because people, real people talk like that. Like this isn't Mary Poppins because yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Okay, so the next question is: Who was the first person you told that you were pregnant with me? I don't even know. I don't know. Because I kept this secret for a little while because I was like, you were my third kid and yeah. I was 
I was I was 17 at the time. I, I was 18 when I had her and I'd already had two. Um, honestly, it was probably Shakira or Jamika because I was around the, both of them. They were my two closest friends. Yeah. Um, so if it wasn't Shakira, then it was Jamika. Like they knew everything. Yeah. Um, Jamika's like my aunt and Shakira's like, is she my godmother or yeah. doesn't godmother? She's your brother's godmother, but she was like your godmother. Yeah. I was my best friend since I was 11. Yeah. And basically all my friends have been around me since, Yay. you know, junior high school. So, yeah. uh, no new friends. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no new friends. I'm, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, but yeah, it was either one of them. Because they were my closest friends with me then. Yeah. Okay. So the next question is, what would you have named me if I was the opposite gender? Listen, I already know what she was going to name me before I got my name because she told me it was going to be Zoe. Zoe. She told me. Okay, I already know. I still love that name. Yeah. I don't know why. No, I know why we didn't name you that because your dad wanted you to name you your name. Yeah. But uh, what would I have named you if I was a boy? I honestly probably would have gave you something. It would probably like have been a Z name. A Z like, name? Like probably Zaire like a Z. I don't know. No. Probably something like they wouldn't expect like a Zachary or something see cuz I like like honestly like, even though we're talking about if I was a guy I really like the idea of like giving girl guys names yeah like, I think that's so cool I mean maybe you would have been a Jamie or something or like an ambiguous sort of yeah name I wanted it to be something different regardless of what it was right. um, that people are like you wouldn't think expect yeah. to have yeah um, so yeah um, probably something like that <laughs> the next question is, did I look more like you or like dad when I was a baby? Me. Yeah. You, you looked a lot like me um, when you were a baby. You had this weird phase in like your, your pre-teen years where you looked a lot like your father. Um, but you looked, the mo you looked the most like me. I do. Um, I'll put I some don't. pictures here yeah. so you can see when I edit. Yeah, you looked more like me when you were a baby um, than, and then when you hit you know, you got out of puberty, and then you looked oh, oh you look like twins, exactly like me. Yes. Uh, but in like in that middle area, when yeah. you're like nine to like fourteen, yeah, you looked a lot like your father. Okay, maybe it's because you were around your aunts a lot. I don't know. Yeah, maybe because uh -huh. they all kind of look, they all kind of look like dad, and Ali is the one who looks exactly, exactly like, like Nana. Exactly, like, like exactly like Nana. Looks like your father and your grandmother. And then sometimes I would look like Auntie Diana, and yes. it would like freak me out. Like I would yeah. look exactly like her. So. Faces I think change. sometimes you look more like me because you pick you pick up a lot of each other's characteristics True. and behaviors. Yeah. So that could also be We're around each other more, so yeah. we're bound to morph into one. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Next. Uh, okay, next question is, how did you choose my middle name? If you don't know, my name is Samaja Naomi. Um, not like one name, but it's just Samaja. So. so your middle name? Yeah. Um, Naomi is my great... Nana's name, um, Nancy, who was my, my dad's mom, who helped raise me and helped show me how to raise their kids. Um, that was her mom, um, and she, you know, she lived upstate New York. We will always visit her, and right after her, like ninety something birthday, the last time I ever got to see her um, was right before uh, Maj was born, and it's been like a tradition for a while, and like a couple, few, quite a few generations in my family to name. Um, the middle name of your children would be like an older family member's name, so you'll be named after like a grandmother or a great grandmother, and that's will be your middle name. My middle name is Marie, and I'm named after my my grandmother. Mm -hmm. um, Justin and Lee are named after my mom and my dad, so their their grandmother and their grandfather, and she's named after our great nana Naomi. Yeah. Okay, took a little break, but we're back. Uh, how long were you in labor? With me. With you. Um, okay, so story time. <laughs> um, I went into labor with you a week before you were actually born. So uh, I was supposed to be born like in the first week of March or April? No, you actually were supposed to be born the middle of April. Okay. So you were about five weeks early. Um, so I went to labor with you and I, my water started to break a little bit and we went to the ER um, and they stopped my water. Um, they thought it was Braxton Hicks, but it really was like they stopped the water because you were still a little over a month early. Um, and then I went home and then about a week later, I went into labor with you in the middle of the night and it was the beginning of the blizzard. 
in 93. So I was in labor. The question was labor, right? Yeah, how long I, were you in labor? Uh, labor with you, I'd say about, you were born around 7 in the morning, almost exactly. It was like 7.35. Like, your dad got there in the morning. It was hard to get through the snow. And I remember he was there with me when I was giving birth to you. And I looked at the clock. I, like, glanced and looked at the clock while I was cursing him out. <laughs> um, nice. And it was roughly, like, 7.35 in the morning. And I went at night. So I want to say probably about... 13, 14 hours. Wow. Yeah, about 13, 14 hours, which you're the shortest one because your sister and your brother I was in. No, your sister was the shortest one. Um, your brother was like 26 hours. Oh, God. Um, but you, you were about yeah. half, a, you were about half days. You were about 12 to 14 hours. Dang. Yeah. And what was Take the, two. what is the best part about being my mother? What is the best part of being your mother? Mm -hmm. I like that. I guess it's a a mother or you guys as mom, but I like that we can joke together. Yeah. Um, I like that we do things together when your brother just has to show up. Yes. Um, I like that we enjoy spending time together. It's not just a not passive a struggle, thing. Yeah. I'm, I'm enjoying it. I don't expect that. That may not always be the case because you guys are still like you're going to mm -hmm. move away and have you know whatever your life paths are mm -hmm. and if you have kids and and spouses and you know d different chapters and you may not always want or you may not even have time you're living your own life so i like that even though everybody is roughly figuring out their own path like you all still enjoy spending time with me and i can spend time with you guys and you, you guys aren't like oh mom like, yeah go do something like you, <laughs> you actually like spending yeah. time with me um and i think that's because we always I always took you to do the things that I liked doing. And so, um, a, yeah. So you don't, you don't mind it. I know sometimes I'm kind of annoying when I'm moving. No, um, I mean, I just, we're, aren't we all? Right. <laughs> so, but I, I, the best part, and I like to see how you guys change yeah. um, and how you're growing up into your own people. Like it, the first thing I, I, I think one of the first things I said about loving being a mom, even though it's hard. <laughs> um, is that you guys are all just these three unique people. Yeah. Um, that happen to have my DNA. <laughs> uh, but you're all e extremely different and the same at the same time. And I like to see how you all are growing into your own human beings and going down your own paths and figuring out your own crap for yourselves. Yeah. And I, I like that part. Okay. What age of mine did you hate experiencing the most? Hate is a strong word, so like, what's like one age where you're just like, I don't like you? <laughs> oh, this is an all of you, again, this is an all of you question. Probably you around 12, 13? Yeah, hitting uh, that teenage. Uh, yeah, hitting that teenage years. Oh yeah. God. I think that was the, the year that I called y'all little assholes. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> and your brother, because he's your brother, yeah. thought it was hilarious your brother thought it was so funny that i was just like you're getting on my nerves you're, you're being a little, little asshole <laughs> and that was your early teen years like right. y'all like you were y'all were awful yeah just it's awful that. i yeah. feel that yeah. Yeah. my soul yes. <laughs> I, I love you soul. but you just wow they're very strange questions yeah do they need to know this is not tea mom i'm drinking they know i'm 25 they watch the vlog i'm drinking I'm classy. It's in a mug. It's in a mug. Mine's is in a mason jar. So I mean, get with this Victoria Von. Where was it? Victoria it Von, Von Vanderville Von Vandercourt. Vandercourt. It was Victoria Von this. Vandercourt. Yes. I'm gonna sip my my uh, prosecco. Prosecco out of a mug, <laughs> coffee mug with my <laughs> pinky out. Yeah, pinky's up. Okay. Um. I can't really put my pinky out because I broke my wrist. But okay, we can pretend. Uh, what? It says, what's your all-time favorite picture of me? Again, it's all three of you. No, I had, one is the picture I have. Well, all three of well, us? All three the of you were picture? babies, yes. Yeah. It's a happy and sad picture. It's a happy picture because it's the one baby picture I have where it's all three of you guys together because I have your separate mm -hmm. baby pictures. But we went, I remember my stepmom Letty took us, we went to go um, to the Sears, the mall in Jersey. Um, and you take the little Sears picture and you guys all just like looked up at the same time and this is you were one. Mm -hmm. um, you were baby, 
well, you all were toddlers, but it was you, your brother, and sister. Um, and this was before you got sick, so it's just your face before, you know, your eyes and stuff. And it was all through you together, and you all, like, cooperated for the picture, and it was such a great picture, which is why I love, I love that picture. I also... We all look like puppy dogs. Yeah, yeah, all, <laughs> yeah, I had, yeah, I had, that's why I called, that's, I called the monkeys M-O-K. E -E. <laughs> um, because they all had round faces and like these big round cheeks. Um, we all got softball heads. Yeah. Um, yeah. But I love that picture of you guys because it's all together. And I also simultaneously don't like that picture because that weekend when, when we came home was when your dad died. Yeah. Um, so that's like, oh, I remember this and I also remember this. But it's also like one of my favorite pictures of you. And then there's that um, elementary school picture where you're wearing like the blue striped. Oh, you're doing I put it on Instagram oh, and I got that. roasted, okay? I put it on I Insta story and I got roasted. There was one of the times where you were just like happy to take a picture and you smiled and you could used to always hate like having to explain about your eyes and stuff. stuff. Yeah, um, I still did to the Because you were in public school. Me. The public schools here are in the Bronx. Are they're shit. shit. It's New York public school system in the Bronx. They're shit. They're, they're, they're shit. still they're shit. They're fucking shit. Uh -huh. <laughs> but you used to hate when people would ask you about it and that's when it was really bad in your glasses just, and everything. Yeah. But you generally just like smiled and you could like did your hair. My hair was long you didn't too, have to look like your school uniform. Yeah. And you just took that picture and you looked so cute in that blue sweater. And it was a very 90s school picture, but that's one of my <laughs> And I had these stupid freaking wire frames. I, Cause I first, that's when I first got my glasses. And I had like a pair of skinny like black frame ones. And then I had these like weird octagon yeah. shaped brown ones. Like that's was, me being weird. And then was, I was just the like, these glasses weren't that cute. But um, I'm like this. My yeah. eyes so so slim you can't even see. But she like generally yeah. just like looking forward to picture day, and she yeah. smiled, smiled. So that's like one of my favorite pictures. I remember I was like, I'm so excited. If I could find it, I'll put it right here. I think it's somewhere in here. We, I'm sure we I'll have. I'll find it and yeah. put it in here. Okay, and then the last question for this is, I mean, obviously. Um, are you happy with the way I turned out? Yup. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Wow. <laughs> The yes. shade of it all. Okay. <laughs> now I know how you really feel, Mom. Okay. <laughs> okay, guys. So that's it for this mom tag. Like, hopefully you got to hear more of what my mom is, you know, like and you know mm, stuff like that. Kinda. Kinda. You yeah. know. Um, so yeah, that's it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Easily. For me. <laughs> no, these. <laughs> None of these. Or you make it. Hey, hey, she's spicy. She's spicy, guys. She's spicy. But yeah, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Um, share it. Comment down below what your mom is like. Um, if you have a close relationship with your mom. And what is one of your goals for 2019. Um, so yeah, if you liked it, like I said, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I will have all my social media handles right here at the bottom. And I will also have them down in the description so you can go and do that if you want. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it and I can't wait to see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. Bye. Bye.